This is DashboardSymbols.com. I have seen several mentions to not use the cabin heater in an EV in cold weather, even in vehicles with a heat pump, but to rather use the seat and steering wheel heaters for warmth in order to maintain the vehicle's high-voltage battery charge. This was even a surprising recommendation in a hybrid manual. And I'm seeing undeniable evidence that this is useful. Watch as I turn the heat on in the Kia Nero, which has a heat pump. The range drops off 7% immediately. The heat that's supposed to be heating the battery is now being brought into the cabin, hence the drop. Even an adjustment to the heat settings have a negative impact on range, both blower and temperature. The Polestar 2 never showed this much sensitivity on screen, but then the car annoyingly only counted down miles in groups of 10. It did give estimated range at the end of a trip when using mapping. That figure would be impacted by the use of heat and particularly when defrosting the windshield. I've learned to use a small amount of cabin heat for only a few minutes at a time. The range tends to return to normal in between. A bit of battery and climate control maintenance. I will keep an eye on this and report any additional useful tips. For other helpful automotive videos, generally covering push button and keyless start cars and key fobs and other technology, look for more from us here on YouTube subscribe to this channel or go to dashboardsymbols.com.